Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if your Wi-Fi is not working properly after updating your Windows 10, usually after a major feature update. So this should be a pretty straightforward tutorial, guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. So we're going to start off by opening up the start menu. Type in Network Reset. Best result, should come back with Network Reset listed directly above System Settings. Go ahead and left click on that. So this will remove then reinstall all of your network adapters and set other networking components back to their original settings. You might need to reinstall other networking software afterwards such as VPN client software or virtual switches. Your PC will be restarted. So two things, make sure if you're using a Wi-Fi connection as in the case of you watching this video that you have your Wi-Fi key nearby because when we restart our computer after selecting this reset now button it's going to reset your Wi-Fi settings so you're going to have to enter back in your credentials so make sure you have that nearby and then also you want to save and close out of any open programs or applications as well before selecting reset because you're going to have five minutes to restart your computer before it's automatically restarted so just go ahead and make sure that's taken care of both of those topics and then select reset now select yes and then you will be signed out within five minutes I'm just gonna do it manually here and I'm just gonna right click on the start button select shut down and sign out I'm just going to restart you could do a keyboard shortcut you could open up the start menu there's 20 different ways on how to restart your computer but you guys just saw how I did it pretty straightforward I mean you could just shut down and then turn it back on too I mean that's achieves the same result All right, guys, so you can see it asks, do you want to allow your PCs to be discoverable by other PCs on the network? You can if you want. Otherwise, I'm just going to select no. You might select yes if you are sharing folders, printers, other devices, that kind of thing. But um, that's really not part of this tutorial. It just was more about resetting our Wi-Fi settings. So hopefully this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.